Max Legacy for Syracuse. Well, Max Legacy is the veteran. Nine years in the AHL. He started three games. This is his fourth start of the season for the Syracuse Crunch. He's currently 1-1-1, one, one, and one, posts an 894 save percentage. At the other end of the ice, back in goal for the Marlies is Keith Petrozelli, and he's had an outstanding start. He's 2-0 right now, only let in one goal in both of his, uh, his games so far this season, so he's been outstanding. Usoff and Shaw at center ice. One by Max Legacy. And put ahead on the breakaway. Shot stopped. Cleared. Blocked by Ben. Gets in the way there. Comes back out front. Chance scores. Rifles, who was the one who was upended, ends up in the zone. Gave them all, the crunch the opportunity to set up. And this comes off of a rebound. Moves it along, Holmberg, Hoffenmeyer back to Goddard. He's got help out front. Shoot! I don't know if this went top shelf on its own, if there was a little deflection off a stick, but it got up there in a hurry, right under the crossbar. And Goddard gets his second goal, gets the Marlies on the board 1-1. That is a terrific looking goal. Carries it down into the corner, looks out front, steps out. Hangs on, moves it up by the Kaiser to the goal, scores! And we can take another look at this shot, see if it goes straight in. It looks like... I thought it went off Slagert's elbow, but it didn't. After a 10-year career in the NHL. But he scored some other ones in another league. That shot comes across, that one drops in the goal from Smith. Completes the transaction. Three for his second point of the game. Oh, Abramoff. Plays it back up high. Hoffenmeyer leans in. Kicked at the side of the goal. Legacy picks it up. Scores! He's got a big shot, and he's going to let it rip. And it just creates chaos in front. Puck bounces out a couple times before Durogachinsev manages to throw it in from the side on a bad angle. Wow, the angle on that. To find the back of the net or the top of the net or any part up high to the line it comes. Cross ice, give it away. Here's Joey Anderson down Main Street. Shoots, scores! Joey Short Henderson puts the Marlies up 4-2. And turns on the Jets. You can see he reads that right down Broadway and just past the glove of Max Legacy to give the Marlies the 4-2 lead. Joey Anderson has got a couple of on Sunday afternoon. Turns but ends up in the corner. Back high to the line. Shot there out front. Scores on the backhand as it came off the pads of Petrozelli. They draw within one. Who had who? And uh, unfortunately, Marley's not able to get the puck out. Syracuse works it around. Up at the line. And that one is up and out. Now here comes Gaudet for Anderson, who takes the 8.15 into the city, taking care of business with a minute 34 left to go in the third period. And they come across the line, but they lose the puck. Play it back out. Five seconds left to go. Steves takes a shot from Smith. Abramoff on his backhand. That'll do it.